Welcome to the Tuesday edition of David Palmer's Drink for the Day. And today, I want to do a drink that's going to be a little more interesting than what we've seen in the past. And it might harken back to the very first one we did, the Sazerac. But a little bit different and a little lot stronger, actually. Um, today's drink is called the Brain Duster. And if you look back into the late 1800s, this was a phrase used when maybe your, your mother or your father or your good buddy and you're, you're walking down the street and you say something dumb or you do something dumb and they smack you on the back of the head. That was called a brain duster. Well, the drink was then invented, oh gosh, late 1800s, what was it, 1895. Um, and it was originally called the brain duster. Later on, the Waldorf Astoria actually took the same exact drink and they named it the Hold Your Hat drink uh, because of its strength. But let's go ahead and start this drink up for you. It's another one that we're going to shake in a glass. Um, we'll get some uh, ice in our cup first, in our shaker. We don't need that anymore. Um, we're going to start, it's a one equal ounce of everything. Um, all three are alcoholic though. And then there's dashes of bitters, but let's go start with two ounces, because remember we always make two drinks. Two ounces of our fine Kentucky Old Forester bourbon. Here's the kicker, and this thing is a monster. Don't play with this and don't have it around flame. Copper and King's Absinthe at 136 proof is a powerful drink to be dealt with. Equal parts, so two ounces of Absinthe. Ooh, that's a, that's a lot to handle. And then two ounces, obviously one ounce if you're doing one drink, of sweet vermouth, also known as Italian vermouth. This is going to be a little interesting. A little bit of bitters. Since we're making two drinks, two, I always do two and a half of each one. Now we're going to shake this one. The garnish here is kind of special too. I love the garnish today that we have for this drink. I was unaware of this product until a family member pointed it out to me. Luxardo Maraschino Cherries. These things cost more than a Rolex watch, but I understand why now that I've tried them. They're absolutely amazing. These put all other Maraschino Cherries to shame. So let's make sure this is nice and cold and get it in a glass for you. You know, family would be the ones to give you a brain duster. Today's a good day to actually talk about family. Family's the most important thing in your life besides your religion. Always put your job in third place, but keep your family in front of everybody. Look at these cherries as I pull them out. They are just absolutely, I'm going to put two in each one because they're so special. Just delicious. There we go. There we have our brain duster. Be careful with this one, folks. It's not for the young or faint at heart. As you move forward today, I want you to remember we're negotiating our new norm, as I always say. This one's especially a, a brain duster, a smack in the head from family, friends, those people who care about you most, who point you in the right direction. The good Lord knows this has happened to me many, many times, and I've frequently needed a brain duster, both figuratively and literally, from family to help me out. So today, reach out to your family, give them a hug, have a brain duster, and drink a bourbon. Please look at the bottom of our screen when, you're, when you get a chance. Please subscribe on our YouTube channel. It really does make a big difference. The more subscriptions we have on YouTube, the more chances I get to bring you guys to a party.